Hey guys, so for today's video, we are gonna do sock curls versus scrunchy curls. Uh, if you don't know what I'm talking about, sock, scrunchy. So I'm gonna do sock on one side, scrunchy on the other, and we're just gonna see what happens. So let's go ahead and get started. I don't wanna make two separate videos, so I'm just gonna part my hair down the middle and just do one on each side, and we're gonna see which one looks better. I'm really excited about this video because I've been wanting to try these two ways for the longest time and I just haven't done it because I always do rope curls if I'm being honest, but I'm down to try something new. These are the kind of socks I have. I have like ankle socks. I kind of have like medium socks and then I have these long boys. So I'm not sure which one I'm going to use yet. So we'll come back to that. As far as scrunchies, I just have like, I don't know hair all over them first off but these are just kind of medium ish scrunchies they're not super big but not super small first I'm just going to make sure my hair is nice and brushed and then I'm just gonna do a center part right down the middle okay parting my hair down the middle just reminds me that I need to get my hair done so what I'm gonna do first I'm gonna start with the sock side all right I'm just gonna tie this other section off I'm just gonna do do a bun and just tie it. So what you want to do first is just kind of mist your hair. You don't want it super damp, but you don't want it too dry. So just a mist. This is water. Don't let it fool you. I'll even drink it to show you that it's, it's water. Water. You think by now I would buy like a spray bottle um, and just fill it up with water, but I have so many of these bottles everywhere. I just rinse them, clean them, and use them. Okay, our spray bottle has malfunctioned. The only other spray bottle I have is in my bedroom where the baby is asleep. He's taking a nap. So I'm just gonna do a little bit on my hand, I guess. Oh, oh. All right, maybe this will work. Hopefully it's not like too wet. So I kind of want to start off with ankle socks just because I do have layers and I don't know, these are small and thin and I feel like they'll be easy to sleep on. So I'm just going to take a section up front and then just wrap it. So when I'm wrapping it, I'm kind of twisting my wrist. I'm hoping this gives me like a little bit of a different curl. I'm going to make sure it's tied against my head. Wherever the opening is that you would put your foot into, I'm just going to take that, put it over like this. Oh, that's so cool. So nice and secure you don't need bobby pins you don't need hair ties nothing just a sock all right we're gonna keep going with the ankle socks and take another section and i'm just going to wrap my hair around and kind of twist it roll it up so it's flush against my head take the opening and then just pull it over really really simple so this would, I feel like ankle socks will be good if you have short hair or medium length hair. If you have crazy long hair, you'll want to get bigger socks. So far, so good. If you have stubborn hair that doesn't want to curl whenever you do heatless curls, try using tum, tum, try using some type of spray. Uh, styling spray, just something that's going to hopefully give you some longevity with your curls. So let's wet this side a little bit. You just take your scrunchie, I'm gonna put it underneath and just kind of wrap it around itself. These are smaller scrunchies, I guess, for my hair. So, so I'm just gonna put my fingers through and then just grab the ends. And you can see it makes it nice and secure. Yeah, if you have a lot of hair, you'll definitely want to buy bigger scrunchies. Okay, it's wrapped, so I'm going to put my fingers through and then just pull the bottom through. Easy. All right, so I'm not going to talk. I'm just going to do the rest. Okay, this looks crazy. I feel like some type of cartoon character I can't think of. Really interested and eager to see what these curls look like. So I'm going to show them to you up close, kind of show you what they look like from the back. And yeah, 
we're gonna sleep on these suckers and see what they look like tomorrow. I will see you guys in the morning. It is the next day and I'm in the same shirt. Don't judge me, but I am so excited to get these out of my hair. So let's go ahead and start on the sock side. Okay, here's this side. Um, looking pretty good. Not sure what happened with this one but the others look really good so i don't know honestly i thought they'd be a little bit more like springy but that's okay they're loose they're beachy i'm i'm feeling it i feel like these are going to be like really tight so let's see All of them are out. They look the exact same. Am I seeing something different than what you guys are seeing? I think they look the exact same. So I'm gonna kind of put my fingers through it and just kind of like shake it out. Okay, think in your head which one you like best and I'm gonna share which one I like best. The sock side. <laughs> I don't know, I feel like this side is just more like voluminous. The curl pattern looks a little bit better. Like this right here, what is this? So although the sides look like extremely similar, I think I like the sock side a little bit better. I like that it was comfier to sleep in. It was super easy to pull out of your hair. It didn't tug on my hair, it didn't pull out my hair, nothing. Um, very, you know, clean. This side, it looks a little bit more loose. Um, you can see they're kind of falling out. Honestly, I'm kind of disappointed in both of these methods because I put these curlers in at 3 p.m. yesterday. I wanted to film when there's daylight. I really didn't want to have my curlers in all day and all night, but I was like, whatever. We'll just deal with it. So I literally had these in my hair for like 15 hours. Um, and this is the result. Like, what? If I was able to redo these, I would definitely probably dampen my hair a little bit more which is weird because like robe curls I don't have to really dampen my hair that much just like a mist and my curls always turn out beautiful but for some reason uh, just wasn't the same with these for funsies let's just brush them see what happens so could I go out in public and wear this and be great all day absolutely no issue um, just not the result I was expecting. So I'm going to part my hair like I normally would. So I will definitely try these again in the future, but for now, I'm going to stick to my rope curls because it just gives me the best result. It's the easiest method. It's the comfiest method. I think I'm going to make this a series because, I don't know, there's so many different heatless curls out there that you can do, that you can try. And I want to try them all. I want to try every single heatless curls method out there. Yeah, that's what I'm going to do. So stay tuned for more. This one, it was okay. I don't know. Let me know what you think in the comments below. Don't forget to like, subscribe, leave a comment. And I'll see you guys in my next one. Bye.